the man everybody wants to see come on, come this on, afternoon. Man. James Coppinger is about to come on for Rovers in his gold kit. No room for sentiment from Darren Moore, though. He's bringing James Coppinger on to make a difference in this game, yeah, isn't he? That's it. Yeah, Coppinger's a little bright spark on that. The man who can create something. If he scores, I'm on the pitch. <laughs> honest to God, if he scores, I'm on the pitch. With those lovely white and gold boots, if one of those boots were to fire the ball into the corner and get Rovers something from this game, I think the whole place with the people that are in the ground would erupt, wasn't it? Coppinger on for John Taylor then. First Rovers appearance in a couple of months. It's before Christmas and Scott Robertson will come on for Matt Smith. Bostock, another substitute who's made a difference in this game. Dictating from deep. Ball into the feet of Bogle, who looks to spin away from Burke yes, just outside that. the area. The free Bozzi. kick given Get in a on good this area. Lakilo fancies free kicks as well, doesn't yeah, he? Yeah, there's, there's a lot of speciality in this department now. Coppinger's name written all over it. Yeah. Surely. He's, put his, he's got his hand on it. Come on. Oh. What a moment this would be. It's the moment you dream about as a kid, this, isn't it? Last minute with a free kick. Or equaliser. Or equaliser. <laughs> Sorry, yeah. <laughs> equaliser. Coppinger and Bostock look like the two most likely then. Coppinger on his day, of course, in his kit, with his new boots on, is the stage set for James Coppinger to get Rovers something from this game. Not to put any pressure on him, but this is a massive moment. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't feel pressure, does he, Coppinger? Pressure. Pressure's for pipes, isn't it? Or tyres. Or tyres, yeah. <laughs> Coppinger and Bostock over it then. The referee's oh, whistle wheel wait. There might have been an arm from Coyle on Bogle there. In front of the referee, not a few, only a few yards away from him. The wall is set. We're 11 minutes into stoppage time at the keep mode. Coppinger, Bostock over it. Coppinger's going to take it right foot to Coppinger. He's done it. It's James Coppinger's time. What a strike from the Rovers veteran. His final season with the club in his shirt. Pick that one out. Oh. What a goal. Oh. How long's left, Robert? <laughs> you tell me, Danny. About oh. two and a half minutes, I think. It could be I anything. Honestly, I'm shaking. And that's not because I'm freezing cold. It's because what I've just witnessed is absolutely oh my astonishing. Goodness. Oh, that is incredible. That is amazing. It's a pinch yourself moment, isn't it? For James Coppinger, <sighs> the man of the moment. <laughs> Unbelievable. I don't know about you, Danny, but it sends shivers down your spine, something shivers. like that, doesn't it? Oh, Unbelievable. All sorts. Electric shocks are going all over <laughs> me, Robert. I had everything. What a moment. Oh. It has to end in a draw, but what a draw it was, Danny. Oh, Rovers what a game. beaten into injury time before the man, the legend that is James Coppinger, steps up, free kick outside of the penalty area, into the top corner, give that and everything man, went mental. Give that man a knighthood. Give that man, give him something, because he deserves, oh, my word. What a moment to produce James something, Coppinger. To produce something like that. We talk about pressures for tyres and that. Wow. Oh. <laughs>